Welcome to the World Drone Market Channel. Today's video is about how to use the Dual FPV Camera Hub to connect two gimbal cameras simultaneously to the MK15. The video is divided into three main parts. What materials are needed, how to connect the cables, how to display the results. What materials are needed, the equipment used includes MK15 Remote Controller, C Dual FPV Camera Hub, CA8 Mini, CA2 Mini and Tata Battery. The cables used are A8 Video Transmission Cable, Dual FPV Camera Hub Video Transmission Cable, A8 Power Cable. How to connect the cables? Connect the Dual FPV Camera Hub to the MK15. Use the Dual FPV Camera Hub Video Transmission Cable. Connect the A8 Mini to the Dual FPV Camera Hub. Use the A8 Video Transmission Cable. The A8 Mini's connector is GH1.259 pin, while the Dual FPV Camera Hub's connector is GH1.258 pin. Connect the A2 Mini to the Dual FPV Camera Hub. The A2 Mini's connector is also GH1.258 pin. Power up the devices. First, supply power to the MK15 receiver. Then power up the A2 Mini. Finally, power up the A8 Mini using its XT30 and SH1.254 pin connectors. Set up the camera addresses. Use a USB cable to connect the A8 Mini to a computer. Open the C Assistant software to change the A8 Mini's camera address. This step is crucial to avoid address conflicts that would prevent the two video feeds from displaying simultaneously. After changing the address, disconnect and reconnect the A8 Mini's power. How to display the results? Turn on the MK15 remote controller and open the CFPV app.
you can see both gimbal camera feeds displayed simultaneously. You can switch between the feeds or control the camera's movements as needed. Testing complete. Thank you for watching. For more content, stay tuned to the World Drone Market Channel. See you in the next video.